Senegal's presidential candidates kick off their election campaigns on Saturday after weeks of violent protests across the African country following the postponement of the votes. The 19 recognized candidates vying for the top job now have less time to rally supporters ahead of the March 24th vote, which is expected to be most closely fought race since Senegal's independence more than six decades ago. Former Dakar mayor Khalifa Sal, who is running for the fourth time, organized a caravan through the streets of the capital to launch his campaign. The front runners are likely to be the former Prime Minister Amadou Ba as the choice of the ruling party and the jailed Basiru Diomaefai, a lesser known candidate who gained popularity as the leader of the disbanded Pasteur party. Diomaefai has been behind bars for almost a year but is due to be released in time for the elections after a presidential decree on the pardoning of political prisoners. President Macky Sall, who is barred by term, limits from standing, postponed the elections last month, just weeks before it was scheduled to start on February 25th. His announcement that the vote will instead be held 10 months later plunged Senegal into chaos as opposition protests filled the streets. Senegal's highest electoral authority, the Constitutional Council, rejected South's postponement and ordered the government to set a new date immediately. The government spokesman Abdul Karim Fofana announced March 24th as the new date earlier this week.